Hi there, my name is Cameron, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about the Arlo Ultra Plus cameras. More specifically, it is not an overall unboxing or review. It's going to be a semi-review, but primarily, I'm going to be sharing with you all the way that I troubleshot an issue that I had, because maybe you're having the same issue. I bought these cameras to put on our front porch as well as to shoot video on our driveway and the day after I installed them and downloaded the app, it wasn't working properly. It worked properly when I first installed it, but overnight something went screwy and I got the error message. To be honest with you, I don't remember what the error message was, but what I do know is that when I went to the library to view my recorded videos, they weren't there. So what the cameras were doing was they were working like if I wanted to view them in live mode, but when I wanted to, to view anything that had been in the past, there was nothing in the library. Now I did go to the Arlo community page website thing and tried several different things. I tried to remove the batteries from the cameras themselves and replace them, hoping that might work. I also attempted to restart the home base on the actual home base. There's a very small pin type of reset button that I stuck a pin in to reset it. Also through going through the app, I restarted the device, device that way with no success. And again, the reason I'm making this video is because I'm hoping it, it would help you the way that it helped me once I realized what the, what the fix was. Okay, so if you've come to this video and you wanna know the fix, here's what I did. I realized that somehow I made both cameras inactive. So they weren't working. And I felt so silly once I figured that out. But in case you somehow deactivated or, or somehow through an update or something they became inactive, I want to explain to you how you could go in through your app and make them be go from inactive to active. What you'll want to do, and I'll show some screenshots right here. You'll want to go into your Arlo app and under settings on the far right on the bottom, you will scroll down to smart notifications. And when you click that, you'll see your active cameras and your inactive cameras. And if you were having the same problem as me where it wasn't, wasn't working properly, wasn't recording, maybe your cameras are set to inactive. So what you'll need to do is click edit at the top and drag them from being inactive to active. Hopefully that helps you. If it was helpful and that works for you and you're as excited as I was, I mean really, I was this close to returning the cameras because I was so frustrated that it wasn't working. If this video has been helpful to you in any way, please consider clicking the links in the description below if you want to potentially order a doorbell through Arlo, uh, extended power cords, and or a third camera. Uh, those are all gonna be links to Amazon, and when you purchase them through that link, it gives me a little payback, cutback, and I greatly would appreciate that if this video has been valuable and helpful to you. If it hasn't been, I'm sorry. And I'll also put the link to the community website for Arlo below because hopefully if this wasn't a resolution for you, you can post in that community and people will give you an answer. That's where I found my answer to be. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this and it was helpful, give it a thumbs up. And if you wanna see other items that I'm gonna be reviewing and talking about in the future, please consider hitting the subscribe button. Once I got the cameras fixed for the last two weeks, we really have enjoyed having them. We feel secure having them installed outside of our house and they work really well. Daytime, nighttime, at about 4.38 every morning, it, it sees our cat, Mr. Bojingles, walking by and I have no complaints. All right, thanks again for watching.